My name is Pascal. I'm a professor at the NU, and I want to talk about this amazing class that we are preparing for you guys. But before I talk about the class, I want to talk about a revolution. A revolution which is happening right now and which is changing the entire world. That revolution is already changing medicine, using DNA for opening the door to personalize, to personalize medicine targeting treatments to every patient individually. This revolution is already putting implants in the brain of people such that they can control artificial limb automatically or such that they can make deaf children hear for the first time. This revolution is changing our cities, our transportation system, making them more livable, more efficient. This revolution is also changing education, making it available to many more people while at the same time making education more personalized. The revolution I'm talking about is also changing the way we are managing our resources, moving from a fossil fuel society to a green economy which is using renewable energy, solar and wind for powering our infrastructures. This revolution is also changing the way we understand the world, collecting massive amount of data that we can't even store. It's also changing we understand people. For the first time in the history of mankind, we are now able to understand human behavior at a large scale using social network like Facebook, like Twitter or Amazon Me Mechanical Turk. So you may wonder, what is this revolution? What is powering this revolution? And it's a very, very simple concept. This is the idea of computational thinking. The idea of actually using algorithm and computation to perform tasks which are beyond the reach of the human mind. Now the ANU wants you, the ANU wants you to be part of that revolution. Okay, so we want you to experience computational thinking, whether you are a biologist or a social scientist, whether you work in the humanities, in public policy, in, phys in physics, we want you to experience computational thinking because it's going to change your discipline. Now, you may think that I'm completely insane and my wife actually can agree with you. Because when you think about computers or computing, you typically see a nerd in front of a computer 24-7. Or you can think about Boris, right? This character in the James Bond movie GoldenEye, which is clicking his pen like a madman and then saying, I'm invincible, right? But this is not what this class is about. This class is about the joy and the beauty of computing. What we want to do is to make you experience computational thinking as one of the more rewarding human experiences. We want you to actually build artifacts that are going to be so beautiful, so that you can so beautiful that you can compare them to pieces of art. Now, how are we going to do that? We're going to do that in three steps. In the first step, we want you to snap, not literally, of course, but snap is this amazing programming environment, programming language inside a browser, right? Inside a browser. The only thing that you will use in this class is a browser. And we're going to start snow. We're going to start with this little robot, Carol, my friend. And that particular robot will teach him a variety of tasks, like going over a hurdle. Because essentially, computational thinking is like teaching a kid various tasks and then see this kid doing more and more complex activities. Okay? And once you have SNAP, what we want you to do is having a blast. And we're going to teach you computational thinking in a context, in the context of various disciplines. We're going to go over computational social science. And we will build artifacts like this one. This is a, this is a sentiment analysis, capturing the sentiment of everyone in the United States during Hurricane Sandy. And red is bad or yellow is good. So you'll build something like this as part of the class. You will also build a sequence alignment. You'll take sequence and align them, and that's essentially a fundamental feature for understanding DNA. And one of the other things which is really cool that you will do in this class is learn how to solve Sudoku in the snap of a finger. We'll show you how you can actually solve this thing so that you will never, never, never have to solve the Sudoku in, in your life again, unless you want to. 
And finally, finally, when all this is done, we're going to look inside. We're going to peek inside a computer, inside computational thinking, and we, review, we will reveal the beauty of this architecture. An architecture which is probably as beautiful as the most beautiful ar archaeological sites in the world. So this is what you want to do. This is what the NU want us to do. Want, want us to do for you, to expose you to computational thinking and have this journey such that you can apply it to your particular discipline. So join us next year, we really want you to join us.